Tomorrow is the third Monday of April, which means it's Boston Marathon Day. Athletes from all over the world will make their mark in Beantown. More than 30,000 participants from 122 countries and all 50 states are expected to run, including one Western Mass native. Western Mass News reporter Kristen Burnell joins us live in studio with the story. Kristen? Leon, I spoke with one runner from Chicopee participating in the race and the owner of the official marathon dog to find out what the 126th Boston Marathon means to them. Marathon Monday is back after being canceled in 2020 and postponed to a fall classic for 2021. Western Mass News caught up with Richard Powers, the owner of the official dog of the Boston Marathon. He tells us his dog Spencer has gained popularity at the marathon over the past few years. Every year ever since he's been out there with the Boston Strong flag and, um, you know, he had a pretty modest following. The runners loved to see him and, you know, they would see him year after year. Powers tells us 12-year-old Spencer has been a crowd staple amongst runners since 2015. But having his pup honored as the official marathon dog is even more special, following Spencer's battle with cancer for the past two years. Last year in particular, they were really screaming out his name because um, he almost he almost passed away in 2020. Um, he had, had a three and a half pound tumor taken out of him after, um, you know, in, in uh, November. And it was a miracle that he made it, made it. And it was a miracle that we were able to be there for 2021 running of the marathon. And then shortly after the 2021 marathon, he was, he was diagnosed with cancer. He's looking strong and he's, his odds of being there tomorrow are as good as any other year in the past. Spencer will be cheering on the many participants competing and raising funds for various charities, including Chicopee native Ashley Dion. I am raising money for the Sean Thornton uh, Foundation. Um, it's founded by Sean Thornton, who's a former Boston Bruins hockey player. Um, and he raises money for Parkinson's and cancer uh, research. And I'm running um, because I lost my grandfather in February 2021. Um, he was battling both Parkinson's and cancer. So it was just a really um, perfect uh, organization to run for um, in his honor. So. I'm really excited that I got the, that opportunity to do so. This will be Dion's first time running in the Boston Marathon, something that has much greater meaning to her and her family following the loss of her grandfather. It's been a huge family effort too. Um, and it's just, it's been awesome just to see everyone um, come around and rally for it. But we've actually raised five, over $5,000. Um, so that was really cool too, to see. And, and I know he would be proud of me. The Boston Marathon will kick off tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. And Western Mass News will be in attendance, so be sure to tune in tomorrow morning and evening for the latest updates from the big day in Beantown. Reporting in studio, Kristen Burnell, Western Mass News.